The bottom portion of the Superior Drummer 2.0 mixer works very much like it does in other DAWs. At the bottom, you have specific individual channels that you can select and that are typically named based on the microphone for that channel, depending on which library you have loaded. You can highlight and enable any individual channel. You can shift click to select multiple channels. You can also use the command or control click to select specific channels. If you double click on the name of any channel, you can manually rename that channel as you wish. Above that, we have the output section, and this allows you to modify what output that channel is assigned to. You can also send that channel to an individual bus. Now keep in mind that the output bus functionality is different than the bus send functionality. And this function will basically send a copy of a particular channel to any bus that you specify. That is helpful if you, for example, would like to do parallel compression for an individual channel or a group of channels. The output bus function will completely reroute any channel or group of channels to a specific bus or output. If I select these three kick drum mics and I send them all to bus one and two, and then I solo these mics and we play our groove, you do not hear anything. That is because we have completely rerouted the audio to this bus one and two. Now we have to scroll over to bus one and two, which is located here, and configure that bus to send that audio to a specific output. If we configure bus one and two to send the audio to output one and two, now we will hear audio. You can use this output configuration to send any individual channel or group of channels to any desired output or multiple outputs, as well as any specific bus or multiple buses. Just remember, if you send any channel or group of channels to a bus, you must remember to enable that bus and send that either to another bus or to a specific output. Now, at any point, if you start routing various channels, and you just want to start with a clean slate, simply click on the output button for any channel and click on this stereo option. That will reroute everything to the default stereo one and two channels. If you want to set up Superior Drummer to send out the audio to multiple channels so that you can utilize plugins within your DAW, simply choose the multi-channel option. This will configure each channel with a predefined multi-channel output, sending the audio to multiple outputs for further processing in your DAW. Now, if this is not the desired multi-channel output configuration that you want, you can manually configure your own multi-channel output setting by specifying the output for each individual channel. This functionality is covered in detail in our multi-channel output tutorial.